Welcome back to Lemons and Larkspur. Today's garden video, I am finishing up a really fun project that I can't wait to share with you and also giving you a sneak peek of what's to come next. I wanna thank you for stopping by. Let's get to gardening. So as you know, we are going with a hacienda kind of look back here. So I found these gorgeous pots. I have six of them six of them. I found them at Marshall's um, for $12.99 each. I have seen them at Lowe's for $25, so it was a half price savings, which is wonderful. But I have these that I am going to fill with succulents. I thought succulents kind of have that kind of um, Mexican, Spanish vibe to them, and they're going to be in shade, require very little water, um, Actually, they get a little bit of morning sun. So they're going to be in um, a little bit of morning sun, but mostly shade in the afternoon, which I have found here in my garden is the best place for a succulent. So I'm gonna pot these up today. I'm gonna to show you all I did was take cuttings from my existing succulent plants. So easy, you can't go wrong. Uh, they do sell soil specifically for succulents. I didn't buy it. I am going to use my regular uh, potting soil and I'm going to add some extra perlite to it so it has really good drainage because that's really what succulents need. They do not like to sit in water. So let's go ahead and get these potted up. These are the succulents that I'm working with. Um, uh, like I said, I took them off of my existing plants. Basically what I did was clip the ones that I wanted, pulled the bottom um, leaves I, I don't, I'm, I'm gonna call them leaves. I'm not really sure technically what they are. Pulled the bottom ones off, which left me with this um, tray full of them. And I will show you how easy it is to propagate these to get more succulents um, for the future. But right now, all I wanna do is add some soil to this, get these potted up, and show you how pretty and how easy this actually is. just want to make sure that the succulent nodules are under the dirt. So basically you're just going to press it down wherever you want it to be and continue. place them in the soil and they will themselves form little pups which will fill this out even more. I'm going to take the side that I clipped and just place it into the soil. Can you see that? There's one right here. Basically, I'm just going to repeat this process for the other five pots.
these regular terracotta plates. I painted blue to match the blue on the top to kind of tie it all together. Pretty. today's video I'm just curious do you like succulents do you grow them it took a while for me to really embrace them I was not really fond of them my husband loves them so I've been growing them for a few years but I have to tell you I'm actually finding them to be such a peaceful pause in the garden I cannot wait till this patio comes together I will of course share it all with you
is it for today. I'll see you in the next video.